This is Seymour Rocks reporting from Down Under. Uh, I'm just coming from uh, trying to upload a movie that I've made with an update on the Arctic ice to just explain kind of the conditions that I have to deal with uh, all the time. So I successfully put this together and uploaded it onto YouTube and uh, despite having not changed the settings, the settings are always the same, uh, it came out as a private movie and I went into YouTube beta and I could not find a way of editing that out. So I've, as we speak, I've deleted the movie and I'm trying to upload it again. So I just, it's really hard to go back over what I've had to put up with over many years, but I'll just go back a few weeks. So as you are aware, uh, a couple of weeks ago, uh, I did an interview with Dane Wickington of um, of geoengineeringwatch.net, and but and I successfully got that out in the end. The week before that, when we I had put together Zoom and got to uh, work out how to use it, and then I had everything absolutely perfectly set up and prepared, including all my questions, absolutely everything. So as you do with Zoom, I sent the uh, the uh, invitation to uh, Dane, and on the morning he uh, tried to come in on the uh, on the meeting. And uh, and I was waiting and waiting, no Dane. And then finally he said, I've tried, but this has never happened before. Uh, it's told me that it's a false meeting or, or something. Anyway, he couldn't come in on the conversation. So we tried and retried that, I think, three times. And then we... Um, we just realized that we had to give up on that one. So we decided to um, to move to Skype, which I hadn't used for some time. And then we came to use uh, Skype. Um, all I got was my voice, whatever I did. Uh, and at this stage, I didn't I didn't have headphones. Um, but it just echoed every everything I said. And then those echoes, uh, turned into a kind of electronic uh, interference uh, noise, which I've experienced uh, when I've tried to do things with uh, with Margot. So we we were unsuccessful. We decided we'd have to come back the week later. I went off to uh, to uh, Talpo for a few days break, and then when I came back the very next morning. Uh, I did the interview with Dane, but this time, instead of sending him the invitation from my email, I used my partner's email address uh, to send the invitation, because um, it's my contention that you know it's the artificial intelligence that's that uh, and algorithms that are that are playing around with my system. Um, so yeah, so we uh, yeah we got that up. And then, um, oh, because you know, I'd, I'd ordered in uh, a geek to, to fix my computer because uh, as of leaving, it was just kind of only just chucking over. It was clearly in not good shape. So I ordered in the geek. And then he, when I came back, it was working fine. I didn't I didn't reschedule him, so I got him in. He did a few things, uh, got plenty of money out of me, um, and then when I checked, um, there was, everything on my desktop had changed. Uh, but the worst of it was uh, that I couldn't record. I couldn't get any 
sound with my new uh, headphones, which I'd bought and been using happily for some time. Um, and yeah, so I couldn't get any sound. So really what it worked out was I used three methods of recording. I use QuickTime uh, sometimes, um, I use Zoom sometimes, and then I also use uh, something that is generic to the Mac operating system um, for recording uh, desktop. And that always has worked really well for me. Uh, but on that, I couldn't get any sound at all. On Zoom, uh, the uh, settings were, 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 had been changed uh, so that it just went automatically into record mode. So I, cu I couldn't do any introduction or talk to anyone without recording it. And then um, on QuickTime, several days running, um, I, I, I could record my stuff, but I couldn't export it. And then yesterday, uh, all the changing, all the uh, settings on my microphone had changed and uh, everything kind of came across really softly, softly, unless I put the the microphone input settings right up to the absolute maximum. So I've had to pay someone to get this right and so far it's working on that part, uh, but it remains to be seen just whether I'm able to get this uh, movie up or not. I'm a little bit uh, dubious and suspicious about that because it contains information um, that, yeah, the powers that be clearly do not want you to know about. And I've said why. So anyway, that's just a little bit of uh, background. Seymour Rocks reporting from Down Under.